As a woman, when I first sought financial advice, it was daunting. And the more I learnt, the more empowered I was. And I think all women should know everything there is to know about their financial future. While I was working, I really didn't pay much attention to my superannuation. To be honest, I didn't even open the envelopes that they sent me every year. I went to my financial advisor and asked where I'm at now and what are my options. And my financial advisor then worked really closely with me and guided me, informed me and gave me lots of options. So he would do things like draw buckets on the whiteboard and explain my different options and then say, think about these options. Next time I see you, you're going to tell me which one you're most comfortable with. I decided to leave teaching, leave Sydney and move to Bangalore. I do a walk every morning. I do the lighthouse walk twice a week. Being retired, I now have time to do the things I really like to do. Just enjoying the good life, not having to rush everywhere. For anyone who's considering retirement, I would say the first thing you need to do is make an appointment with your financial planner, start working out what you want to do, when you want to do it and how you're going to get there and listen to the advice, get upskilled, get more knowledgeable. Seeing my financial planner empowered me to be in control of my future. It was my dream and my financial planner helped me make it come true.